Alright, hello and welcome back to another episode of the Telltale Games Walking Dead Season 1, Episode 2. Oh, what a mouthful. Here it is. Anyway, Saint we're... John family day. We're at this nice, friendly f place with Y'all cool can people. see how we kept this place so safe. Uh, the sure. Fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. That, I don't get 4, it. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. It's okay, guy. She doesn't understand batteries, so I wouldn't worry about it. Oh. Um. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worse protecting. Hence all the juice. Uh -huh. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, Sorry, I just... Mm, yeah, John, no, and it's okay. I just theory. recoiled in this pain from the piercing right. noise of her A voice. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone no. with survival experience to lead your group? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got things in my Yeah, room. I'm in charge. I hope you know what you're doing. That place isn't safe like it is here. Oh, now you'd be surprised. Here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Comfortable. Uh, we Thanks brought gasoline. Us. Hold on. Sorry? We brought some gasoline on good faith. We're all incredibly hungry. Things <laughs> are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. How did you know we were Can't coming? Can't stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Uh, Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. But we can help you find out. Alright, what's your name, Mark? A vet? If you speak oh, over uh, me one more time, I'm going to butcher answered. you. Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? I have to turn head down head my head volume with the some dinner, a big <laughs> for all you hungry souls. from my my headphones be because nice this woman's voice is so goddamn ear piercing it's probably coming out through the headphones out. into the microphone why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here might want to take someone with you remember those roads can be dangerous I can handle myself take this why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway Take care of yourself. Ah, Ben. Yes, See of you course. In a while. Captain Useful over there. Mark Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Okay, boss. Problems. Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. Well, I don't know. Learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before I they don't run know, dry. man. I feel like get me when you're you should accompany us. This place is it's your incredible. fence. It's what if we sabotage it? What if fence? we try to take your place man, from you? Fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. Hmm. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Oh boy, Andy. Oh, I get to play the game. Awesome. I thought it would just be dialogue and cutscenes forever. Right, let's have a look at this swing. How is that? Huh, yeah, that looks pretty bad. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved yeah, something like this. Yeah, to yeah, yeah. Let's tell kids them about the like kids. Kids like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. Well, yeah, because it's a fucking farm, dude. Who cares? They want to touch the cow and do nothing else. Uh, when was the last time it got any use? Mm, been quite a while. Uh, don't exactly have a lot of kids visiting anymore. I look forward to the <laughs> kind day of suspect. Kids can just be kids again. Amen to that. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around By here. fixing a swing? Uh, okay, Lee, I think you're kind of overestimating the symbolic value of a swing, but okay. Let me go in here. I want to see what, what's up with your house. 
Let me pull up to your crib. Oh god, it's in the Shadow Realm. I love Definitive Edition. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its <laughs> Dude, oh, there's nothing this there. Something. Dad. How? He How did you do this? Good. How did you, you know, fuck it up this bad? I get you out of business, but come on. House. Is that right? After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. He said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. Uh -huh. Mama, she was done after damn. My folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left of daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourself. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. There's no reason for them to want to share it. If anything, they'd want to maintain it, so... You lie, you lie. Anything else? Can I like look in the window and be like, oh, apparently there's wind chimes up there, but maybe you can see it, but I sure as hell can't. I used to have these on the front porch <laughs> oh, of my there they house are. Up. Hope the noise doesn't attract any unwanted guests. And what about the plants? Mm, fresh herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. Um, what, Lee? No, no, no herb. I'm going into your house. Hello. Well, hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Danny. Oh. He's got a okay. lot of on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Damn, are you piggybacking on him or what's up? Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. All right, well, well whatever. Lee, I sure appreciate it. No I don't feel like talking to this lady. Uh, any any more of her voice than I have to is uh, too much. It's too ear piercing, man. Too ear piercing. Oh, generator, picket fence. Let's have a look at that. Mm, point. <laughs> Good take. This is too big right now. But if I can find something to cut it down to size, this might make a good seat for the Dude, swing. what is it with the swing? Mm. Well, that's something to cut it down with, I Mind guess. if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. Okay. There we go. I repaired your board into a smaller board. Electric fence. Touch it. Touch it. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. That's yep. pretty expensive to maintain, when it comes though, to isn't it? Okay, well, seeing as we seem to be obsessed with the idea of fixing the stupid swing i guess i'll go look for hey, some rope uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn uh rope how secure is your barn having a safe place for the cows pretty important thanks to the fence nothing gets in here anymore i don't believe you the daddies took most of our cattle before we got it running mind if i take a look sure but uh why don't we do that after we tend to the perimeter sounds good sounds strange all right, Andrew, let's go. Hi. Hello. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? You have no idea. I'm going to not say anything. Just to increase suspicions. Oh, he didn't even care. We can be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Because they would do that. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. You know, like a Defense completely a safe place with unlimited second, food, but... It's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. I'll stay attentive. So how's the place looking? 
Is it safe enough for us to stay? No. We can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. <laughs> Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high <laughs> enough. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. It's okay. I didn't back you. Guys, I'm gonna smack talk him behind him Relax. again. You're not making things any better, riling him up. And then you'll go tell him that I said that, and then I'll say that I never said that, and then he'll get angry at you and kill you. Ugh. Nice. That looks pretty cool. Wait, it's dead. Come on, let's. No, I just wanted to play pinata, dude. Mine. And he said, when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. I don't know. Why don't one of you touch it to find out? All right, Pally. Time to go. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this You're not paid to up, be sure. You just, be just check. Can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? That sounds terrible. Yeah, no. It's dangerous. True, but it's also dangerous to the walkers. So what's no, your take? No, I on mean, the as in like seem to have this place feeling too safe is well. dangerous. We've got enough people to take this place <laughs> by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. Uh, listen, There's man. I need to. I see it. You know, we gotta look out for our people, mainly because I don't like these people. The woman's voice is too ear-piercing. Uh, Holy, that... Maybe we should, like, reinforce the posts as well, yeah, considering... It's burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. Uh, okay. Nice. Nice. That that was very used easy. You never to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Not so much the Christ. fact that something can't stop melted its skin to the. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. Uh, shut the hell up. We'll go ask for more to eat after this is done. All right, I can suck it up. Yeah, you better. I don't want to complain. I think I see them. where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Little help here, Lee? No, I, I, I want to just look at it. If you're waiting it. for that guy to help, it ain't going to happen. Come on. No, I want him to help, though. I don't want to do this. This seems... This seems suspect. Just everything is too calm. Everything is too perfect. I don't like it. It makes me feel suspicious. And now, how do we get back on the other side of the fence? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. I have a better question. How? Okay. Cool. Oh, hey, look, a guy. No idea. Fuck. Now what? Nah. Uh, fence on that gate. Well, we're kind of screwed. Show yourself. Did I say fence on that gate? You Hello. Uh, brakes, probably. What do you mean I got you now? You got nothing, bud. No, I'm not fucked. You're fucked. Oh, nope, still nothing. What about the front side? Nope. Oh, oh, wait, yeah, there's a little brick in front of me. Come on, no. What? What about our racists? What? We can reach the gate. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Okay. Also, I'm just saying, I'm like looking at them run around up there. They could definitely get an angle where they could like dome mark completely. Dude is standing way too far from cover. Oh, how did he get into that kind of position? We pushed them like back. Damn. 
Yeah, no, we would definitely be getting shot of the head. Well, you're gonna starve. How many of those things did we push down? Uh, three, Mark. Well, two actually, I guess, but three. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Kill him. This fence sucks ass if this guy's still alive. How strong is he? Oh, alright, fair enough. No, oh, now he's following us. Nice. I like that. Oh! Speed up, Lee, damn it! Aw, oh, shit. Mark, you useless motherfucker. You asshole. You completely subpar dickhead. Another one? Hey, caramba. I don't know, that's a zombie. Good. How unexpected. No, come on, stop this now. Yeah, and then it's like super buff, and then there we go. And then instead of, you know, killing it, Lee just swings it away. Is this a stable pace? Is this working? Oh god, I can sprint. I did not know that I could sprint. There you go. Alright, cool. Let's get out of here. Okay, but we have no cover now. They could totally destroy us. They could follow us through the open gate. I don't I don't get it. Why did they give up? I don't think I have anything to say about this. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah. I'll be alright once it's out, but god damn it hurts. Hey y'all! Mark! Oh my god! What happened? He got pranked. Christ! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just... pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Oh what? no. Must be the what kind of shit is this? We Why ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch okay, of Okay, but what men. about that fence, we Pally? We stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Well, Carly was working with the information she had. Jesus I meant to press Say three, something. but I pressed four, so I Listen, said nothing. We may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps no, are. Do when you? you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. No, Pandas, are you this. serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay Shut here. Shut up! Safe. This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor. True. Room. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do I is mean, find they a literally way to get suck. our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not oh do anything. Oh my god, can we just wipe your family we... tree off the face of the earth? I've had it with you two. You guys, you guys are idiots. Make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Okay. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Oh, yeah, that's... I love Team Competent being the ones protecting hey, our place uh, of operation. I remember operation. seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope you kids like swings. A swing? I love swings. Uh. Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Uh, sure you are.
But you know what? I think I'm gonna end it here. So if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you want to hit the bell icon if you want to be notified when there's more, and all that nonsense. And I'll see you next time. Good boy.